Welcome to the Equinity Podcast, where horse owners just like you share their incredible Equinity stories and how Equinity is changing their horses' lives. Whether you're searching for something to give your performance horse better focus, faster recovery, and more stamina, or in the extreme case where all hope seems lost, give your horse what it needs to help heal at a cellular level, you'll find it here. So jump in on today's episode to hear how Equinity is helping horses worldwide. Now, welcome your host, John Dowdy. Hello and welcome to this week's Equinity Podcast. We are swinging up into South Carolina this week. We've got Jim and Stacy Warner on the call. Welcome to the Equinity Podcast, guys and gals. Hello, John. We're excited to be with you today. Thanks for having us. Oh, you bet. It's uh, been a long while. I I may have been twisting your arm trying to get on here for a while, but you guys are super uh, busy, so that's all right. <laughs> we are so excited to tell you about Equinity and what it's done for our horses. Good. Yeah. So let's start out. We're going to talk about two different horses specifically. And so tell us some of the things that were going on you know, with these horses, and this was before you learned about the Equinity Horse Excel product. So tell us a little bit about each of these horses. The first horse that we tried it on, and then we were sold. We were at our wit's end. We did so much vet work on this horse. We did a bone scan. It didn't work. We did an MRI. It didn't work. We injected everything after the bone scan, after the MRIs, and we would take him back to the vet. And his performance he just would get in a turn. He couldn't stay in the turn. He'd flare off and acted like he was just hurt somewhere and never really could find anything in all the bone scans, MRIs, x-rays, all the injections. In fact, we took him back so many times to the vet. They started re-injecting the same joint. We had to call the vet out. They're like, oh, yeah, we did inject that. So oh, gosh. We were desperate enough, started researching, and we came across your product on social media and then we were able to go find reviews and we thought what the heck let's try this Mm -hmm. we gave him 30 day stall rest he was on equinity for 30 days and then we started slowly exercising him for the next and at 60 days we started running him again and it was like he was back to his old self um this horse went from winning maturity to not performing at all and then it was like a year back and forth trying to figure out the problem until they couldn't figure it out and the equinity is what fixed him and went right back to winning and we were sold on the product and been on it ever since. Wow. So he was on and off lame for a year or so? Yeah. And it was really, couldn't really, there wasn't a physical obvious lameness. It was more in his performance. He would get in a turn and he just couldn't stay in there. He would bail out Mm. and just wouldn't, he'd start to commit and it was like he was hurt and then leave the turn. And, so he wasn't clocking well at all. Sure. And he had tried it, put a good effort into it, but he just couldn't perform. And that's why it was a puzzling case. And that's why we would try bone scans and MRIs and never really found anything. And we did inject everything that there is to inject and it never made a difference. So uh, you get desperate and we started researching and that's how we found out about Equinity and Never look back. Yeah. So after two years, he's been perfectly sound and performing great. Yep. Yes. How about that? And we have not had to do any more injections and haven't been to the vet since. Holy smokes, this stuff must work. And then Jim started using it on his mare. I'll let Jim tell you about that. I had a mare that I ran in the Futurity some, and if we would go to the Futurity the first go-round, she would fire hard, work real great. The second go round, she just was lethargic, wouldn't just seem tired and just like she didn't feel good. So she wouldn't fire hard the second day. Um, If we would go to a two day show, it was the same day. First day, she was great. Second day, she just didn't feel like she felt good. So she didn't have her snap and didn't fire. And uh, we put her on your product. And I seen a difference in 30 days and 60 days that a huge difference. She would come back the second go round as strong as the first and, and it really made a huge difference. Wow. And she's been on the same same time frame? A couple of years? Yes. Yeah. And didn't have any of those issues anymore then? No. Uh no, she she's good. Yeah, she could every every run is the same. It's it's not like she drops off like she was before. Right. That's incredible. Now I know one of the other things that we were talking about before and one of the challenges challenges that you have in your 
area are with cracked hooves. Tell us about that and some of the challenges you've had to deal with through the years and then how this product has changed the, the hoof quality. It was definitely a difference when we started both of these individuals on a quinity. From the nail holes down, they would always be brittle and cracked. And their hooves strengthened up so much. We're like, wow, this is great for their hooves as well. So we put the whole barn on a quinity. In fact, some of them don't even have to wear shoes now. Their hoof walls are so strong and good, strong soles. Mm-hmm. But it definitely made a difference in all the horses' hooves. And no more brittle hoof walls, no more cracking, no more chipping of the hooves. They're strong. Wow, just an increased farrier bill. Yes. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> which which is a, an all right trade off if you're yeah. working. <laughs> That's right. Yeah, yeah. Now you guys also train a lot of horses. We do, we do. Yeah. So how's that worked in in these younger ones in these colts? We have put all our colts on it, and the biggest difference that's been on our colts is the focus. We haul a lot of different colts, and one of the biggest challenges in your young ones is seasoning them and selling into new places and getting them to focus. And this has made a world of difference on their focus and paying attention and not snorting at everything. And, and their performance is so much better because they're dialed in. Right, right. And that's, you know, the things that you're describing are, are things that we hear, I mean, all the time. And for those of you tuning in for the first time, maybe you've just learned about, uh, you know, Equinity. And we've got two products and we're specifically talking about the Equinity Horse Excel right now which is uh, 100% pure amino acids. There's no fillers, there's no sugars, no starches, and there's no loading dose. It's just one little tiny scoop about the size of a teaspoon. And it's the same dose, whether it be a Colt or a 2,000-pound draft horse. Um, they all get the same dose. Yes. And the reason why is because the amino acids are specifically formulated in this stack to give the body what it needs to release hormones from the pituitary gland. And when you can do that, it allows the body to send its own hormones to the problem areas. So in essence, it's customizing to each horse. So this is a perfect example with uh, these two horses you, that you described where one, you know, the performance was off, kind of mystery something going on and you tried everything and you started giving it a quantity and it fixed that whole situation. And then and yeah. with Jim's, you know, after the second day or after the first day, rather, going in the second it was, she was just done, and so it solved that issue. And then you get into the cracked hooves and then the focus. And that's one of the things, too, that's so interesting with this product is it doesn't really fit into a specific category of a hoof supplement, a joint supplement, a recovery supplement, or performance supplement. You know, again, we're giving the body what it needs to help repair itself, and that's what makes it so unique. And this time, we've been on the market seven years with the Equinity Horse Excel. One year ago, we came out with a second product called Ultimate OEC, which is a flaxseed-based omega-3 oil. It's got 1,000 IUs of natural vitamin E and colloidal silver all-in-one. And so this is serving two specific purposes. One, it works in combination with the amino acids to give those repaired cells some nutrition to help them operate at optimal levels. And secondly, it's a really powerful antioxidant, which helps reduce inflammation. And so I know you recently had started using the, or you had added the OEC. What's the biggest thing that you've seen just by adding the OEC? To the- we have started using the OEC. And I can tell you on one individual, Philly, we were having uh, multiple episodes of her tying up. And we tried so many different things with her feed. We took her off of pasture so she wouldn't get any sugars in the grass. And we still were not getting any kind of results. She was still tying up. And we put her on the OEC and it fixed her. She quit tying up and made a world of difference. And now we can uh, show her and she's performing well. So it definitely corrected why she was tying up. We don't know, but it definitely leveled her out where we can perform on her now. Yeah, that's great. And we've actually heard that uh, probably a handful of times. You know, we don't get feedback from every everybody, but some of the people that have called in say, hey, do you have any testimonies or anybody hearing that this has helped with horses that are tying up? And yes, we have. And here's another one. Yeah, it works great on her. And I'll tell you too, it makes a big difference in their coat and their top line. And if you have one that's fallen off in weight, uh, a lot of our colts 
you know, that when we start hauling them, get a little stressed on the road. And this has been great to maintain their weight or ones that need a little more muscle tone in that top line. It sure put that on them. Yeah, exactly. And what's really interesting is we've had a lot of this, the same type of testimonials just with the amino acids. And then when they add the OEC to it, it seems to make it all the better. Oh, yeah. And, yeah. you know, I always tell people as well, you know, because the, the OEC is a lot more expensive. It's eighty four ninety nine uh, for a 30-day jug. And what makes it so expensive is the natural cold-pressed vitamin E that's in there. Yeah. With the amino acids, we're talking a dollar a day with that. So if you had to choose between one or the other, we'd always recommend going with the aminos. But if you can sure get the other one going, it really makes a big difference in that aspect. So Most definitely. Yeah. And I know uh, too, going back a couple of years ago is when you had reached out to us uh, and you had told me about how the product was working in your horses. And little did I know, uh, you guys were also had just started something called the GTBRA. So Yes, tell, we did. Yeah, so tell us all about that. What does that even stand for? It's Good Times Bell Racing Association, and we're super proud of it. We're in our second year and doubled our membership size, and it's just our last barrel race had over 500 entries at Perry, so we are so excited at the growth and the changes that we wanted to make in barrel racing. The contestants are getting the benefit from it. We created it because we are contestants ourselves and saw the need for some changes with payoff, ground, schedules. So we were able to do it and we pay really well. We pay deep. That was one of the changes we wanted to make. There's so many tough horses in the industry now, not enough places paid. So we go really deep with our payout. Mm -hmm. And uh, the biggest thing is ground and facilities, making use of some of these awesome facilities in our area on the East Coast. Perry, um, we have three big, Perry, Georgia, uh, have three big venues a uh, year there now. And we go to Conyers a couple of times a year, T. Ed Garrison Arena in Clemson. Now we have Asheville and we'll just keep expanding. We're looking into some Florida venues as well, but we're super excited about the growth. And the main thing was being contestants. Uh, what, what, what could we do different? for the contestants uh, awards are another thing that kind of has died in time so we make sure that we have good awards at every show and uh, prizes to give the members so it's we do a lot for the contestants and the members and try to give back that sure was lost yeah and i'm sure with you uh both competing the way that you have and then being able to uh compete and run the show does make a huge difference because you understand where the writers are coming from, because you are that. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, definitely. Yeah, that's, and I hear, hear you have a great announcer at your shows. Oh, my gosh. My partner, Andre Dorn, she is, I couldn't do it without her. She's the backbone of it. She's the one that does all the office work, and her husband, Ryan Dorn, is the announcer, and he does sales rallies and motivational speaking, and he is the best announcer you could ever have. <laughs> that's he awesome he has a voice for it he used to work on radio so he's uh got a great voice for it nice nice and um you also um started webcasting these events as well we have yeah yeah are you getting a lot of viewership that way as well it is incredible because we while we're doing the webcast we can see the reach and it's up to ten thousand people watching and the last webcast that we did at perry went international and we had a piece someone reached out to us and asked if they could share it on their page and our webcast was being viewed international. So that was pretty dang cool. Yeah. That's, and I mean, yeah. for, for the growth. And I remember when you reached out to me a couple of years ago, of course, as an Aquinity company, you know, we're trying to grow and partner and have strategic partnerships as, as much as we can as well. And when you told me about the GTBRA and you know, what your goals were and just the whole vision of everything. It's just like, it matched so well with what we were trying to do, which is one reason why we, you know, partnered with you guys. So it was definitely a win-win and, and just getting the Equinity name out there with your guys' name out there. And that's why I wanted to have you on the podcast as well, to just to talk about the show and kind of what makes it different from other things that are out there. And the growth that you're having, as you mentioned, is uh, pretty awesome from the first it year is. to the second we year. We feel so blessed. And what's really, really cool about this show is we're so hands-on working 
the show the entire time. And I'm right down there on the floor, like during the exhibitions and talking to people. And there's so many that use the Aquinity. So I've gotten to do some little interviews myself over the last few years. And, and it's so rewarding to see others that use Aquinity and have you as a sponsor. And like you said, it's a win-win. And to hear what their testimony is just makes you believe in the product even more. Yeah, no, absolutely. So, well, is there anything else that you'd like to touch upon? Or maybe if there's somebody on the fence that's thinking, well, this all sounds good. Now I will throw this in that, you know, we do these podcasts on a weekly basis. They come out on Wednesdays. You can find them at teamaquinity.com. I will say that this is not a miracle supplement or supplements. However, they do some pretty miraculous things uh, from all the testimonials that uh, we gather in here and can read all over the place. So always obviously keep that in mind, but uh, the odds of our products working are on the very high side. So if there's somebody that's tuning in, they're thinking, well, I'm a little on the fence. Is there anything that you would have to say to them to to get them to try the products? Well, I can tell you it is overwhelming because everybody's looking for that fix. Everybody goes through the same thing. We're riding horses that are performing at a high level and they're going to sustain an injury sooner or later. It's like the, Ben horse that we couldn't find it 100% fixed him after all we went through him and all the vet bills it did no injections all the money we spent in bone scans and MRIs never really could find it but that did fix him and you exhaust yourself trying to find that fix and for the cost it's just a great overall supplement to keep them on uh, monthly and it just will cut down your vet bill so much. And if you have a performance horse, we just highly recommend it. It just makes such a difference in their performance. And like Jim was telling you earlier on the mayor that the second go round of a two day show, she just wouldn't perform as well. She's tired. She wouldn't clock as well. And after being on it, she ran strong the two go rounds and could come back and perform just as good as she did the first day. She never, never had any lameness trouble, but I just knew she didn't feel right you know the second day she felt like a different horse she was lethargic just didn't have the energy and and couldn't figure out why and uh like i said the product sure made a huge difference on her sure so for us it wasn't necessarily trying to fix a uh, lameness or a uh, mysterious lameness that we never could find it it helped her with her stamina it helped our horses hooves and because we had a lot of hooves that were their hair coat, like Jim said, and a lot of the hooves were brittle and breaking. To the point now, we have a couple we don't even shoe. It made their hoof wall and their soles that strong. So there's so many reasons to be on it other than uh, that fix yeah. that it did fix for us is their overall wellness. Sure. Yeah, we have a lot of people that use it as a preventative as well. Correct. Yeah. Now, uh, going back to the Jeep TBRA, uh, is there... What Right now, what states are you primarily in? North Carolina, South Carolina, Georgia, and Florida. Gotcha. And so if somebody yeah. wanted to, uh, you know, become a, a part of the association, is there a, a website that they could go to to inquire yes, about that? It, they can, and it's G-T-B-R-A, the acronym for Good Times Barrel Racing Association, dot com. Dot com, all right. And always follow our Facebook page, Good Times Barrel Racing. Gotcha. And we'll have that posted. Uh, this podcast will be transcribed and then we'll have those links in the transcription as well to find you. So Great. Perfect. Yeah. Awesome. Well, Jim and Stacy Warner out of South Carolina, thank you so much for taking the time to share your story and talk about the Good Times Barrel Racing Association here on the Equinity Podcast. We enjoyed it. Thanks for having us. Glad to do it. That's all for this episode of the Equinity Podcast. For more information on purchasing Equinity, be sure to visit our website at teamequinity.com, where you'll also find product information as well as more testimonials on how others have seen amazing results by implementing Equinity into their horse's supplement regime. We'll have more stories on how Equinity is helping horses worldwide right here on a future episode of the Equinity Podcast.